Hi guys, it's me, the Pecan Tan Beauty, and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be just a quick reveal on a bag that you guys have seen before. I have had this bag maybe about three weeks. I haven't carried it yet. I have been inspired by, first of all, my Dooney and Burke Clayton satchel in this color, as well as some of the other Dooney Nistas who also have this bag in their collection. So I found one and I, it was in perfect condition. So I thought that I would pick it up and add it to my collection. So I just wanted to do a quick reveal and share it with you guys. So let's see what I got. So the bag that I recently added to my collection is the Dooney and Burke Florentine Leather Satchel in the color Crimson. And again, like I said, you guys have seen this bag before. A few other Dooney Nistas have also recently just picked this bag up. And I have a Clayton satchel in the same exact color. And I fell in love with the color and I just knew that I wanted another bag in this color. It's not too dark, it's not too light. I think it is the perfect medium for an all year round bag. And I do not separate my bags by season. I carry all my beautiful bags all year round. It just depends on what I feel like and what kind of mood I'm in. This bag comes in a mini, a small, and then also in the large. I'm trying to see if it's coming off true to color. It's a little bit brighter than what it is in real life. Either way, it's gorgeous. So again, I'm not gonna go over many details because I know you guys have seen this bag before and several other reveal videos. So I will just go over some of the basics. You guys know I love to be very thorough when I'm doing reviews and reveals. So I might go a little bit overboard. I know with the Dooney & Burke Florentine leather, it comes with this beautiful brushed gold hardware all throughout the bag. It has a detachable strap which attaches here. It has these beautiful tassels on the side with this green suede which is also lined on the inside of the bag. It has pleating here on the side just to give it a different little bit more classier look. It has our Dooney and Burke logo here in the front. And you guys, what makes this bag pop, in my opinion, is the stitching on the bag. It's done in like a, like a yellow gold stitching. And let me give you a close up, just so you can see how gorgeous that is. I think it's beautiful against this crimson color. It has a braided zipper pull. It also has four feet. The handles has a brown Timaro whip stitching just to give it a different level of dimension. So now let's go onto the inside of the bag. So here is the inside. It has a very, very nice size mouth to be considered a small, in my opinion. It has our standard pockets. It has our Dooney and Burke patch right here. It has a zip pocket and also a very nice size slip pocket. On the other side, again, our standard Dooney and Burke pocket. It has a, a snap pocket here, as well as a cell phone pocket on this side. We also have our key keeper and also a detachable and adjustable strap. And I'm just gonna hook it on. It has a nice size drop here. It has five adjustable settings where you can make it either longer 
or shorter. And as you guys know, these Florentine bags are very, very substantial. They do have a little bit of weight, but to me, it doesn't bother me that much. The hardware is just phenomenal on these bags. Very nice hardware. It has double stitch handles, which is also stitched with that yellow gold stitching. Okay guys, so this is it. My Dooney and Burke Florentine leather satchel in the color crimson and it's in the small size. I also wanted to give you guys a quick color comparison between my Dooney and Burke Toledo leather satchel in the color rouge compared to the crimson color in the Florentine leather. It's a little bit different. The Florentine is a little bit deeper and richer in color whereas the Toledo leather has a lighter, more subtle look in my opinion. But they're very, very close. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna do just a few mod shots just to let you see how she looks on the body. Mm -hmm. 